Hello everybody, this is TN Couponer here. Let me turn this down a little bit. I'm watching WCCW back in 84. Uh, this is my WrestleMania 39 predictions, which takes place, I think, this Saturday and Sunday. Hopefully, it'll be a good WrestleMania. Not a great build to WrestleMania this year, but hopefully, everything will be good. Uh, first match, we're going to go Austin Theory versus John Cena for the United States title. I don't see Cena needing this title. And I think he's got movies coming up, so I think Theory retains. Now, this could be a sleeper match. Rollins versus Logan Paul. Rollins has not won since WrestleMania 35. So, he's in a position we can just put other people over. So, I'm going to go with Paul. I'm gonna go with Logan Paul. <coughs> Third match is going to be Trish Strass, Lita, and Becky Lynch versus Damage Control. I'm actually going to say Trish, Lita, and Becky are going to win the match. Hopefully, Damage Control can rebound after this. There we go. Hopefully, they can rebound. Brock Lesnar versus Omos. If you want to shot the WrestleMania crowd, I'm going to predict Omos is going to take Brock Lesnar down within five minutes. I'm just saying, if you want to shock her, do that. That will be shock the world. Let Omos beat him in under five minutes. All right, the next match, Bianca Belair versus Oscar for the Raw Women's title. This is a little thing you didn't know. Oscar is actually winless. At Mania. Winless. I'm actually pulling for her. But my prediction is going to be Bianca. I just don't see Bianca getting that title taken off her anytime soon. Alright, the next one is for the SmackDown Women's title. That was Raw Women's title. Charlotte Flair versus Rhea Ripley. I see Rhea getting her revenge from the other WrestleMania. To a young man with Charlotte beat Rhea for the NXT title a few years ago. So now, Rhea gets to beat her. Like a revenge match. <coughs> now this right here could be a good sleeper match. Don't sleep on this match right here. I see Ty on the line. Triple threat. Gunther versus Sheamus versus Drew McIntyre. I'm picking Sheamus. Because I want Gunther. If I was booking this. I would book Gunther to be the men's money in the bank winner. And eventually become the world champion. That's just the way I do things. Okay, next one's Hell in a Cell. Finally. A Hell in a Cell match is not a Hell in a Cell. I love it already. Edge taking on the Demon Finn Balor. I know Edge doesn't have long to go in his career. So I'm assuming Edge is going to win this. And maybe he's got one more tile run in him. But we'll find out. <coughs> Alright. I think this is called the Women's Showcase Match. It's Liv and Raquel versus Nat Natalya and Shauncee versus Ronda Rousey and Baszler, which I call them the Raccoon Sisters, versus Green and DeVille. I like this team right here, but my winner is going to be the Raccoon Sisters, and I'm assuming they're going to go on the night two to take on Becky Lynch and Lita for the tag team titles, and that's how Rousey's going to get her revenge on Becky, because she's either going to pin her or make her tap. So the Raccoon Sisters will leave WrestleMania the new tag team champions. Just my prediction. I have the men's showcase... Strowman, Ricochet versus Street Profits versus Alpha Academy. I'm not even going to worry about them. Oh, this is so distracted. Versus the Viking Raiders. I like Strowman and them, but I think the Viking Raiders should win this match. I'm going to go Viking Raiders because they'd be a great team for KO and Zayn to take on as their first challengers. And I think the Usos will lose the tag team titles to KO and Zayn. And this is Ray versus Dominic. I'm actually looking forward to this match. Can't believe it. I think they're they're going to perform a good match. Hopefully, I'm wrong. On, hopefully, I'm right on this prediction. Cause it's been a long time since the Hall of Famer actually won their last match, so I'm hoping Ray wins. But it wouldn't shock me if Dominic goes over. <coughs> Alright, the main event: Roman Reigns and over his not her. Day tile reign versus Cody Rose, the Royal Rumble winner. And I don't think he's been defeated since coming back. I think Reigns retains to get to that thousand day level. So, you know, the WWE machine can market that. 
I don't think Cody's going to win that title. I say Reigns loses at SummerSlam to Jey Uso. And that will complete the circle of the bloodline. To the bloodline's begun with the rivalry between Jey Uso and Roman Reigns. That's how it should end. Alright. There's my thoughts on WrestleMania 39 prediction. I know it's been a long video, so if you watch this whole video, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Alright, this is Team Coupon. Hit that like button. Comment down below. Subscribe to the channel. Do all that crazy stuff. And just saying, have a great night, everybody. Bye.